Welcome, Welcome back to the basement, the friendliest place on YouTube. YouTube. We've got some mail from uh, Dan Unda. From down from the old Outback. That's not how they talk in Australia. There's, I'm not. I'm trying to be the British guy. That, I mean the American guy. There's a bloomin' onion in here. <laughs> oh, or a wallaby or a didgeridoo. What do they call well, aircraft carriers in Australia? Aircraft carriers? <laughs> Just aircraft carriers? Aircraft carriers? Just aircraft carriers. That's what Mr. <laughs> uh, Agan told the us. Wallaby or something. We gotta sing the mail song. Oh, we sure do. Take it away. I'll follow you. <clears throat> All right. And a one and a two and a one, two, three. Opening open in the mail, mail today. today. We're, We're opening open the mail with you. you. We're gonna, We're gonna open mail and have a nice time, time and see, see what, what we got, got from Australia. Australia. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. All right. <laughs> okay, so this comes to us. That's my didgeridoo impression. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> Touch of death. So this has a list of things that are inside of it. Ooh. So I know there's multiple things. This comes to us from Australia. What a cool looking package. The Australian Post is a way cooler looking box than the so, United Postal Service. I'm gonna try and find oh. the letter without looking at too okay, much. Okay, yeah, now. I didn't see anything else. Okay. Ooh. This is a big piece of paper. A big piece of paper. Oh, there's a great drawing of you and I high-fiving. Oh, dude, I love it. Like the beginning of the little, 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 little. We do that whenever we see each other in public. <laughs> like, when we see yeah, each other in the grocery store, it's we're definitely like, ah. weird. <laughs> People are like, you guys are weird. And we're like, you shut your dang mouth. When we, we happen, slap them in the face. When we happen to see each other. Yeah, it's true. It doesn't happen super often. In the, I mean, if we're not already, like, like planning to be some. Right. Yeah. <clears throat> to the basement. And there's a basement couch there. My name is Nate. Hi, Nate. Hello, Knight. Hello. I love your vids. They are so funny with a couple extra O's there. Oh, dude, yeah. My favorite videos are Animal Crossing Funny Moments. Really? Wow. I'm glad awesome. you like that one. All of the Zelda Breath of the Wild Funny Moments. <laughs> yes. And Majora's Mask. That was a live stream. I was gonna that say I those did. must be streamed. We should we should play that, Peter. We shouldn't do that. Yeah. We have to we have to finish a Zelda game before we start another Zelda. <gasps> we have to finish Breath of the Wild first. <laughs> <laughs> the never ending uh, game. Yeah, Breath of the Wild 2 will be out. Can you do a funny moments on Mario Maker? Question mark. Ooh. Ooh. That's a good idea. That reminds me of a thing that we need to possibly play on. All right. Mario Maker. Oh, yeah, great we idea. We will take that under yes. consideration. Think heavy, that. heavy consideration. Heavy. It's like a hundred pounds. Yeah. Or, or. or 173 kilograms. No, it'd be fewer kilograms. It'd be like 46 oh. kilograms. 46 kilograms. Somebody check my math. How many Kilos. kilograms is a hundred pounds? Kilo. Kilos. Kilo. No, you know you. <laughs> um, I am eight years old and I play Breath of the Wild, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, yes. Animal Crossing New Horizons, yes. and Mario Maker. That's a great set of games. That is fantastic. Hope you like the stuff. Oh, yeah, we haven't opened the box of stuff yet. We're going to find From out. From your fan, Nate. And I will see you next time on, on the, the basement. basement. <laughs> on top of the basement. Dude, yeah, thank you. Thank you so much, Nate, for the awesome drawings and the letters. All right, I think so you should find out what's in there. Um, yeah. We used to say on the basement. Oh, sweet. Oh, cool. Dude, we don't have these. TV snacks? Oh, I love Our I love food original. from different countries, especially like yeah. snack foods. I've never seen this. We we're, can't get them here. We got to try it on camera. So we're going to open Why don't you open that one up? We'll try one. All right, all right, all right. Um, all right. Roy. Thank you so much. Uh, one of my favorite things is uh, they do finally have them now in the U.S. But they're called Tim Tam, and I know they originated in Australia. Oh, those are good. And are they from Australia? The, yeah. Did you ever do the Tim Tam Slam? I don't think have so. Have I told you about the Tim Tam Slam? I don't These think look so. like these might function in a similar way, but it's got kind of like that waxy chocolate coating on the outside, Ooh. and the inside's like a, a cracker wafer. But you can bite the corner. Mm. They're a little oh. stuck together, so I sampled mine before I'm oh, getting yours. That's though. fine. That's okay. I, I trust you. Do you have any hand sanitizer I can wipe this down with first? I'm just kidding. <gasps> oh, blow on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, these are really good. It's the like a nice chocolate. The chocolate in the U.S. It's not just as good. Stinks. I mean, there's good chocolate mm. in the U.S., but like the standard chocolate is not as yummy as this. And yeah, if we had something like this, the chocolate would basically taste like nothing. It'd I mean, be it's like, like wax. A, a, like a crisp, dense shortbread that's oh. not too crisp. 
Oh, that's good. It's really good. Thank you, Nate. That's so thoughtful. Dude, two and boxes of something it. Something that we haven't talked about very much, but I just love snacks from other countries. Anything that's kind of like this. Yeah, well, I mean, we've had durian. We've had Vegemite. Yes. And now we've had TV snacks. Uh, we're going to try real durian in the future. I'm going to get a real one. We're going to have a fresh one in the basement. I'm going to be sick that day. Nah, you'll be fine. But you'll be uh, dead. The Tim Tam Slam, the way you do this, you make a cup of hot chocolate, you bite the corner off of the Tim Tam, and then you bite the opposite corner off it. Then you suck some of the cocoa up through the Tim Tam, Ooh. and then you eat it, and it goes... With hot Ooh. cocoa chocolate goodness. Well, I gotta try that. Yeah, we gotta do that. All right, all right. All right. And what another and here? another thing here. Oh, okay. There's another edible. Sour cream and onion Pringles. Oh, that's the best kind of Pringle. I would agree. Yeah. We, we do have Pringles in the U.S., but it's probably been like three years since I've had a Pringle. Yeah, I don't really eat Pringles, but I like Pringles. My I just favorite. don't, I guess I should say I don't buy Pringles. Here, why don't you open up the last thing, and I'm going to show Whoa. the basement dollars my favorite thing to do with a Pringles is. Is it pop, eat one, and then stop? <laughs> Defying the commercial? Once you pop, I, I work really hard to make the fun stop. Only Ted can. All right, everybody go home. Party's over. <gasps> these are little. Oh, wait, are these normal size? I. Uh, they look smaller than the U.S. Maybe you're one? bigger than the last time you had one. <laughs> That's true. It's been three years. <laughs> this is my. Fi these are smaller for sure. But this you is know what I can't get Pringle. over is the size of this bag. It's a go Goliath. <laughs> oh yeah, you got to do that. <laughs> Goliath bag. <laughs> All right, so we got some Lego here. Hmm. I think these are us. I must be the bearded bald one. Ah! And you must be the hairy oh, pale it's one. Us. Maybe. That's awesome. Ah! Yeah, I'm sure that's awesome. And there's some accessories here. Look, I could oh, be Thor's hammer. I could be Darth Vader or um because oh, you're wearing a hood. I look, look at like you. I look like Kenai Gaming. Ah. And what is this? How disturbing would it be? To, to see a duck. Oh, Thor's hammer, like you said. Suck its own bill into its mouth and eat it, just like I did. And then have lips <laughs> <laughs> underneath it all. <laughs> Turns out all along they were humans. Oh, sour cream and these are so good. I love, they come in little stands so we can put them on the shelf la, where la, they will la, live la. for all eternity. La, la. Nate, this is awesome. And Nate's mom or whoever helped him with the packaging and the mailing, thank you. Fantastic. Uh, that was no small feat getting that f to here from Australia. Yeah, it wasn't cheap either. So we appreciate all of the w everything that went into sending this package. Thank you so much. It's uh, It comes at a good time for us to be able to just kind of snack and enjoy our time in the basement. And hopefully you guys are staying healthy and happy and everything's going great for you. So that's all the mail that we've got for today. Yeah, that's it. If you guys want to send us mail, uh, you send it to P.O. Box 95 in Elk River, Minnesota, 55330. Oh, and that's in the U.S., by the way. Yeah, USA. Um, the basement. You can put that on there. You don't have to. But the post office people know me. I go down there and they're yeah? like, the basement. And you're like, yeah, you don't even know what that is. But yeah. soon you will. <laughs> soon. We should get a billboard. In Elk River. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys next time in, in the, the basement. A very important part of how the basement is able to bring you the content that we do daily is our wonderful YouTube sponsors and Patreon patrons listed on the screen now. If you would like to join this amazing group of people who are helping the basement to make even more content and do even more streams, you can go ahead and click the link in the description or on the screen right now. And we'd love to have you join us in making the basement not just the friendliest place on YouTube, but the most awesome place on the planet. In our solar system. In our universe. In, in the, the basement. basement.